I'm Dr. Bob Salas. You know, there's not a real simple way to determine how many calories you need during competition. A ballpark range is about two to 300 calories per hour, or maybe 60 grams or so of carbohydrate, but it's different in every athlete. I see athletes get into more problems when they overconsume calories as opposed to under-consuming calories. You know, during exercise, blood is being shunted away from your stomach. It's being shunted to working muscle, to the heart and to the brain. So there's not a lot of blood left over to supply the stomach to digest foods. So when you put in too much food into the stomach, it's going to sit there and build up and cause you to develop stomach cramps. And as it gets worse, you can develop nausea, vomiting, and even diarrhea. So that's why it's so important that you're very careful about what you put in your stomach during an endurance event. You need to learn what works for you, how much you need to take in, and what types of foods do best for you while you're competing. You need to make sure you're drinking on a regular schedule, you're eating on a regular schedule, so you're slowly adding in those fluids and foods very gradually during competition so that you don't upset your stomach. By being careful about what and how much you put into your stomach during a race, you can get the calories you need and feel comfortable all the way to the finish line.